Well, good morning, my church family. The time has come where we go, we, we go, where we go to church again to worship and praise our Saviour, the House of Prayer. And you know, I can, I, I cannot wait. I'm like a, I'm like a child on Christmas Eve when it, when it, on on a on, uh, Saturday. Can't wait for church because you know, being in church is the best place you could ever be. It's the most safest place where you could ever be. And I just want to thank the Lord that we have got a place to go to every Sunday. You know, we need, but we need to pray for all the other churches around the world who are unfortunate enough to get to church. So I just wanted to say, church time has come. Church is upon us. I don't know where you. I don't know where you're watching this from, but it's half past seven. My church will start at eleven. I'm gonna do the over it now and took my worship music on and start worshiping. It take me about an hour now to. Uh, well, on a normal day, it should take about ten minutes, but by the time I finish worshiping, it's, it'll, it's, it'll take about half an hour. And I just want to read Psalms one hundred. Joy. Shout the joy to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him with singing with joy. <clears throat> Acknowledge that the Lord is good. He made us and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter the gates of thanksgiving. Go into the, to the courts with praise. Give thanks to him. And praise his name for the good, for the Lord is good. His unfailing love continues forever. And his faithfulness continues each for each generation. Wow. Psalms 100, there's only about six verses in there. And that is clear instructions of what to do. You know, he doesn't say, if you're feeling condemned, don't go to church. He's saying, go to church and shout, and shout to the Lord, sing his praises, because you are not worthy, but he is. He knew you were going to fail before you were born. So can I just encourage you to go to church, be on your best. If you can't sing like me, you can't sing. Just just, just mumble, just make it up as you go along. and Just make the song up as you go along. And then make yourself look good then by belt, belting out the chorus so people think you're a good singer. Apart from that, I can't sing either. But just belt the chorus out and then go quiet again like me. So yeah, come before the throne of grace with, that, with worship and gladness. Enter the gates with thanksgiving. What are we going to be thankful what are we going to be thankful for, you might be saying? Well, the, the thought that your sins are forgiven, you can walk, you can talk, you can breathe, you're alive. There's so many little things, little things, that we can be thankful for. Thank you for your family. Thank you. His unfailing love continues forever. And his faithfulness continues to each generation you know long after we are gone God is still going to be growing his church the gates of hell will not prevail and I'm just thankful that I'm part of his word part of God's life not that he needs me but we that is, should, should be our greatest gratitude that God has chosen us the king of kings the lord of lords the one who died for us, does, he doesn't need us at all. But you know, he's got an amazing plan for us. And I just wanted to say thank you. Hope you have a good day in church. Acknowledge that the Lord is, the Lord is good. I've got, my tam I've got my tambourine ready. When I start singing... Because I'm not shy to start singing, shouting with the Lord, for the Lord. 
he understands there's nothing in the Bible about a rocket. I, 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 unless I'm sitting next to my mother, then I have to be quiet. But on a good note, have a good day in church. Stay well, be safe, be strong, be courageous in the Lord. Amen.